This year, Art Beat alum Mike Leckie won a special commission, a 1% for the Arts Project, for the Albany Public Library. We caught up with him when he and his partner Chris Beck were still a few weeks away from finishing the sculpture and then returned for the dedication. Here's Mike in his own words. <laughs> I came up with the design for the little girl because I had a block of marble sitting out in front of the studio that was a big sort of standing rectangle. And I looked at the marble carefully to see what I could get out of the stone. That's when I came up with the design for the little girl seated in a chair because it fit into this block nicely. This is a fun piece. It's very classic. It's very simple. And yet the little girl has some real movement. She's not holding the book the same way with each hand, and her head is turned and looking at one of the pages, and her feet are crossed in front. I like the way marble engages you when you work on it, because it engages you mentally. One little mistake, and you can't put the stone back. So you have to be extremely careful, and there's no wavering of your mental process. The focus is very intense. Mistakes can happen any place in the process of carving. You get to the place where you only have so much marble to make the hands with. You carve fingers too small, how do you put them back on again? I prefer the uh, careful method of going in a more, little more slowly. I've retained the rights uh, to the maquette and I'm going to have it cast in bronze. I think it's a beautiful small piece and because of its size, it won't really be an expensive piece. I figure we've got um, two to three weeks of finish time left, and everything right now is still a little bit fat on the piece. We haven't gotten to the files of the sandpaper yet, which is the actual finish, so everything you see so far is still pretty big tools. Um, we like it a lot. We think it's coming out really beautifully. Both of us working on it are very pleased with our progress. You literally are drawing on the stone and then carving the drawing off and then drawing it on again and carving the drawing off again and it's sort of a continual process. Right. Fascinating. So we're here to celebrate the arts today. I've sent seven tons of marble home to myself two different times from Carrara, Italy. And this is a block that weighed 4,300 pounds. It was so big by so big by so big. And we got everything we could from the block. The block now weighs, the sculpture weighs 900 pounds from 4,300. So we took off more than 3,000 pounds of marble. I think that this is an icon for the Albany Library. It's the reading girl. Well, that's huge because educating women starts with educating little girls. I'm very, very proud to be able to put this piece here, and thank you all very much. Thank you for the commission. I like it. I like it. I like being able to put a life-size marble in front of a library. It's, uh, it's nice, you know, it makes me feel good. Mike's sculpture is right in front of the new library for all to admire, and if you want your own copy, he's made bronze maquettes of the Reading Girl available for purchase. You can order them directly. Just go to Mike's website, mikelecky.com.